What is going on, everybody? It is me, your boy Perch. We are back with another Dragon Ball Z Dogen by video. And today's Dragon Ball Z Dogen by video. Dude, out of all the missions that we had to do for this Ultimate Thrilling Battle event, this by far had to be the worst one for me because this took me quite the amount of tries to complete. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> doing the actor skill and seeing that I only do freaking triple digits damage is freaking funny. To me. But yeah, this took quite the uh, while for me to complete because of the fact that I I didn't have a good team. Uh, Dude, before uh, as you, before as you see, Riyadh Drobe is in the next rotation. Actually, we <laughs> guys, the most important thing I've ever figured is of course you guys. How are you guys doing? Hopefully, all you guys doing fan freaking fantastic. But before I bought the Yajirobe into this team, I had the LR Plan Battle Gohan, uh, SCR Gohan on this team, thinking that he was going to do uh, uh, like an amazing job for this, what's in for this mission. But surprisingly, he was not, dude. Especially with these group attacks that were being launched. Like, he was taking, like, I think 80k or 50k, something like that, per, uh, like, group attack launch. And I didn't have him, like, in the first or second slot either. Because, and then after he, I mean, after he did a super attack, that's when he would, like, tank pretty decently. But. Dude, these group attacks were just freaking obliterating me, dude. But anyways, I, I'm just, I'm glad that we're able to get this done, right? And then here, uh, what's it called? The Gohan and Piccolo, thankfully, they were taking the super attacks here because they are able to tank pretty well. And then I feel like next turn, too, we are going to be uh, at a, we're going to be below at a certain thresh, uh, HP threshold, which you definitely want to be because we definitely want to get the revive off with the Gohan and Piccolo. So yeah, uh, that is our main priority. I should have probably, though, kind of awakened my Gohan and Piccolo and, you know, brought that as our leader skill because it maybe might have helped us out here, but... Uh, nah, I feel like we, we're still pretty, we, we're doing pretty decently without them. So yeah, uh, here freaking Yamcha's just trying to bring it back for us here, as you can clearly just see, just him doing super tag after super tag after super, which I, I clearly appreciate. I wish I had him rain with it, because this guy is actually pretty darn good. Like, see, like, he went from that, dude, and it, look, dude, quadruple super tags. I didn't, I didn't think I have any, um, any equipment orbs that are, like, do additionals uh, in, his, in his equipment. But yeah, dude, look at that. I definitely want to get more, uh, cops. Uh, dude, I, when was the last time this guy was, uh, featured in the banner? I think it's been quite the while already, but anyways, uh, that's that. And then of course here, this is actually a pretty good rotation because of the fact the LR uh, Tien and Yamcha, I think they reduces this guy's attack stat if they do uh, what's gonna call it a a what's gonna ATK uh, ATK super attack. And here we're seeing one super attack, which is pretty good honestly if you ask me because like I was saying before, we definitely want to be below the uh, HP threshold that we have to revive with the Gohan and Piccolo. And then here, this does quite the amount of damage even though we're type advantage. But funny enough, after they do their uh, super attack or their ultra super attack, they are like they receive way less more damage i think yeah here they reduce uh, attack right we're gonna see that icon oh never mind i thought they i thought we did or maybe maybe it's the 12 key super attack i have no idea i could have sworn i saw them like do uh have the ability to reduce an attack stack uh, but whatever uh doesn't do that much damage but that's fine and then here after the next rotation i'm like okay perfect and then here uh we're we're having this guy below dude oh my god if, if these guys did like another ultra super attack, dude i feel like there's gonna be a unit someday that's gonna be launching like you know yeah, they if you do their ultra super attack, they have a chance of doing another ultra super attack. That has to be like a mechanics, like you know, Doka has to be coming up or thinking of at least, right? But you know, uh, we will see when the day comes, right? If that ever becomes like some sort of mechanic that you know a unit is able to do more than one ultra super attack. But anyways, here we're getting super attack again with freaking uh, LR Nappa, but here we should be perfectly fine because we are type advantage and we did our super attack beforehand. So yeah, we should only one hundred thirty thousand, and then I think. If Yajirobe did not like dodge, I think we probably would have been in trouble. But thankfully, you know, this guy was able to do his, uh, his job. I, we actually do get a bit of healing because I think after a certain amount of dodges, he is going to be able to heal us for like I think 50% HP or something like that, around that around that line. But yeah, uh, this guy uh, doesn't do any damage. Like I said, he's mostly oh never mind. He takes double digits. Maybe it could be because we uh we we had our support up or not support. Maybe because we did our dodges. No idea. But anyways, uh here uh of course. The main important thing here is now we're going to have to revive a freaking Gohan and Piccolo. And yeah, I definitely want, just want to get clapped here. And then we're going to be going on to the next uh, rotation, which I feel like the next rotation is going to definitely be the last uh, rotation for the for this lineup. Because of the fact that, you know, we have LR, uh, Tien, and, and Chiaotu, which is our main damage, really, honestly, in this freaking stage, right? The freaking Piccolo out there with the dodge, which I mean, sure, that helps us out somewhat a bit. But uh, yeah, we, uh, I'm like, dude, please do not dodge in right now because we're definitely trying to, uh, you know, just get clapped and you know guarantee our victory because I think we do get we we do get a bit of healing if we uh, what's it called yeah you see how these guys are taking thirty seven thousand damage now that's that's, that's, that's that's not insane but you know we're we're, we're trying to we're trying to freaking die in this rotation so we can get some some healing up and then also the the active skill animation or the revive animation with these guys dude, it's it's so freaking sad dude it it almost made me cry whenever I would like see it. It, it it's it's so heartbreaking and then yes we are getting super tiger these guys which is perfect and then they didn't dodge out at all so yeah now we're gonna be watching the uh revive animation which is really depressing and yeah let's go cry together after watching this
Damn, dude, it, <laughs> it sort of makes me cry still right now watching it, dude, when I, uh, dude, oh my god, man. It's so sad, man, it's so sad. And, like, funny, it's funny to think of, like, how back then, obviously, since I was a kid, I, I didn't understand too much of emotions, but then now, like, as an adult, of course, you know, all stuff that's happened in life, and, you know, we are, you know, we, we know our, what emotions we, we, we have to feel, and, you know, and then, you know, thankfully, uh, Let's just not talk about that. Let's just talk about freaking freaking Napa just dodging all these freaking attacks that are happening right now, dude. Which you know, definitely, I'm glad it's <laughs> we barely do any damage. Which I'm glad that that is part of his active skill. That you know, you, I mean, you just lose. I think attack power. No, if you use his active skill, which I, I didn't mind. I don't, I'd rather just have the guarantee of uh, dodges because just in case this guy decides to do a freaking uh, uh, a super attack in the first slot. So yeah, we're good on that. And then afterwards, and then yeah, what's like I was saying before, the what's it called the Tien and Chiaotzu. Are going to be able to get the job done for us here because of the fact that you know they just do quite the amount of damage for the ultra super attack. but yeah anyways i still want to say revive animation for gohan piccolo very very depressing uh so sad to see and then here in the uh japanese voice actor they, they killed it and i freaking know what to call it in that scene right there but anyways guys that is going to do it for me guys hopefully you guys enjoyed it like i said the saint saga one was a pain in the freaking butt but at least we got it done and then yeah that's going to do it for me i'll see y'all on the next one peace out everyone